Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ the same yesterday, today, and forever. Yes. Saints and friends, truly I'm glad to be present again. Thanking God for bringing me thus far. He's brought me from a long ways. You know, I went uh, I went 87 years without seeing a doctor. And, I and the doctor got their hands on me to turn me every way but right. They were going to make up for lost time. <laughs> and I declare that I never had so many x-rays and running me through the tongues and all that other stuff that they've done. Seeking, trying to find out, I guess, what's making me tick. But nevertheless, I thank God that I've come through and I'm increasing each day. But my knees are still weak. That's the weakest thing about me now is my knees. But nevertheless, I thank God for bringing me thus far. For your prayers and for for your visitation, for your cards, for your donations and all, I thank God. So I'm telling you that God is real. Oh yes, God is real. And God will always do what he promised he would do. And I was thinking about the Sunday school lesson I was studying. I said, those oh, folks did some terrible things. Those folks act like they were cannibals. Yes, they, they were they was uh, skinning people alive. Mm-hmm. They was cutting the women open and taking their babies out of them. They was hanging them on stakes. I said, those folks, that were terrible folks. I said, well, when Jonah went down and began to preach to them, they knew that they had to repent because they knew what they were doing was wrong. And so they were willing to repent, put on sackcloth and ashes because they believed in what Daniel had said that if you don't repent, it's going to destroy you. And so, but you know, as Israel, they knew what was going on, but them folks was hard-hearted. They didn't repent. They didn't take it serious. But nevertheless, one day, maybe Israel will take it serious and decide to repent from the wrong that they may be doing. So let us pray for the nation because there's trouble in the land. This is an evil day, an evil day. A lot of things happen every day that's terrible. And uh, we pray and ask God to save his people because his people need to be saved. Oh, yes. You need to repent if you're not if you're doing something you know you're not supposed to be doing. Repent. Repent. That's all you got to do. Repent, and God will forgive you. Because the day is going to come, He's going to wish you had repented. Then it'll be too late. So while you, while the breath is running warm in your veins, then seek God that it might get closer to Him. So may God bless you. Pray for me.